I won in the end. Holy shit. But yeah, we got human person. That's crazy. We got human person versus Numa. And this one's going to be a juicer for sure because I know last week human person took Numa to game three last hit. Holy moly. And Numa brought it back with some Sephiroth cheese ball stuff. But uh, yeah, it looks like uh, Numa's going to be opting for the Sephiroth here uh, once again. That's and insane. Yeah, Ferb made the video. When do we play in singles? Uh, right on oh. oh, see you, Rin Rin. All right, I'll see you later. I'll Kyle. be back, maybe. All right. Unforge. But uh, we're going to have. Oh, four Numa. <laughs> He's rocking the four Numa tag. I, you know what? I respect it. He's uh, showing some love for his opponent right before he uh, completely washes uh, him with the human person spirit. And you know what? I respect that. And HP, he's doing he's doing pretty well so far. Ooh, that's gonna be a small shield. Yeah, fair from wedge. Getting a little predictable. So Numa's gonna be up tilt from that. Ooh, back air. Back air gonna get HP. Send him straight to AL, as the uh, as as they say. But uh, we're not. It's pretty even percent. We do have Numa with wing, and that's gonna be some big damage. Oh, and this is the pocket timing. Yes, yeah, so and now he's at kill percent. Uh, this is crazy. Uh, Bad news for the HP community, but uh, we could see some uh, we could see some good stuff here. Ooh, the Nair just gonna take it from the ledge trap. Beautiful ledge trap by a uh, human person. And uh, no, HP has leveled up for sure uh, since do the human person. Uh, that was quite the er that was quite the Miami era, uh, but no, he has gotten a lot better, and he's like giving players like Numa a run for their money, which is crazy. Um, we could honestly, I think HP could take this set. I think it's very doable on, on both sides. We saw last week. Uh, oh, but the f tilt's going to take uh, that stock relatively early. I uh, guess not that early by Sephiroth standards, but, you know, no, no one likes dying at 100. So, you see the side view. Yeah. Oh, nice snare to stuff out the uh, repair. Yeah, HP uh, needs to get a little more careful about... Um, Sending those projectiles onto the counter. But Numa uh, is just doing a great job holding advantage here. Ooh, uh, drops the ledge trap, tries to go for hard read. And HP gonna. Ooh, ooh, okay. This uh, this changes things. Um, this, uh, yeah, he blew it a little early, but it's okay. You know, we still have a little bit of a deficit. Ooh, but uh, HP is gonna get a combo started. And already, percents are about even. Oh, uh, HP's at kill percent. Yeah. That was a, honestly a very good play by Numa, just uh, catching HP drifting in towards the ledge. Uh, what is the Mamsa command? Okay, Mamsa is going to do the Mamsa command again, and I'm going to I'm going to get to see it myself because I was too busy commentating the match. We're gonna go to Yoshi's. This is Cereza core. Uh, if Cereza were going to Yoshi's, he would uh, pick Mario, obviously. No. Ooh. I don't know. That's a that's a mystery to be sure. But uh, yeah, the Mamsa command gonna come in. Uh, it might shake up the outcome of the set uh, just a little bit. And so uh, yeah, uh, HP has Mamsa's strength in this game. And uh, I'm going to test that theory. We're we're going to do a peer-reviewed study on the effects of the Mamsa command on the outcome of the set. I think that would be uh, some very uh, interesting uh, scientific development. But anyways, we're gonna be seeing like pretty even once again. Ooh, yeah, I know what HP is trying to do. <laughs> we all know. Uh, my all of Miami knows. If you're if you're in that situation versus HP, man, you can expect some bullying 
to say the least. Expect a bowling ball coming your way. Uh, I, I know what some people are about to say. Um, just don't bother. It's not funny anymore. And the back air going to take that first stock. Uh, this is quite the deficit. Mm, yeah. Honestly, I like really like the idea from Numa. That, yeah. Numa's just catching on to HP's uh, wall here really well. And uh, it's turning out really well for him. Ooh, but the back throw is going to come in. Let's see what HP ops do here with that. Al almost gets the shield break there. Very good read on the shield by Numa at the mid range. Honestly, that move is just cracked in general. Villager F smash is a Momsa reference. So true. <laughs> Oh, what the? What they got HP doing? Yeah. Uh, oh, okay. Very nice cross up from HP there, actually. Uh, I really like how he opted to play around that counter, and he got some good damage off of it. Ooh. Oh, okay. Right after you got wing too, honestly. Hmm. But it is Sephiroth on Yoshi's. See uh, how they. Yeah, he's getting he's getting aggro, and Numa is it just knows when to play defensive right there with the counter. And uh, yeah, gonna read the air. Yeah, that's gonna be it. Oh, not not quite. We could still see an HP dub. Ops for the neutral get up there. I like the idea. You know, he's getting stuffed by the F tilt uh, a lot this set. Yeah, he's gonna play. Ooh, he's gonna play this off stage and uh, get a little trap there. Yeah, that's gonna be it for sure. All right. Well, uh, that set, I gotta say, it wasn't as much as of a juicer as the one last week between HP and Numa, but HP still put up a good fight and you love to see it.